Hi everybody, welcome back. Chester is like uh, behind the fire, or almost in the fire. Chester, be very careful. You've got a lot of um, really disgusting fur on your body uh, in general, and you don't want to get lit on fire. Uh, we're back. We're running around. I'm running around. I'm going to grab these vegetables uh, and put them in the fridge. We're growing a lot of vegetables. It's got to be said. This summer has been very good for vegetable growing so far. Um, I don't know how much longer is left. I'm assuming a long time because the um, the the thermometer is, is at full. It's at full whack, uh, if that's a term that you like to use to describe things that are full. This one is uh, absolutely just right uh, at the goddamn top of its game. Uh, the thermometer, it, it's a very hot day today. Chester is panting more than he normally would. Oh, I want to get another one of these red birds. That's what I used the, the ice staff for last time and I can remember. I'd love to get a red bird uh, and another feather so that I can make another fire dart. Uh, but that means having to go to the swamp and getting more reeds and stuff. Um, I'm going to head over this way and see um, what's going on with all these spiders. I'm also going to collect grass and twigs along the way too. Uh, just so I can have a nice, uh, steady stockpile of them. Ah, jeez, I keep forgetting. It's day 81, and we still haven't been attacked by wolverines. I don't think we're going to get attacked today somehow, though. I think they have to be, like, summoned at night. Oh, thanks for the seeds, you son of a bitch. So we should be okay uh, out here during the day, I hope. I don't want to get caught too far away from the panic room, uh, but we're going to risk it anyway to see. I mean, the thing is, I got my marble suit, and I got a spear, so I'm, like, pretty much ready to go. What are these, like, creepy, uh, what are these plants? It's all planty. You can only examine them. Do we have the big, oh shit, the, oh shit, do not. Florian, no! Oh, there's like a billion spiders there. Oh, Florian, no, oh no. That kind of reminds me, uh, actually, watching Florian, um, meet his fate there. Uh, we should try to make a pig house. I think that would be good. I think making a pig house would be nice. Actually, I think if you give pigs meat, apparently, they'll follow you around and they help with your sanity, that might be nice, actually. It might be nice to have, like, a nice boost to the sanity. Because I think there's, like, some weapons that you can get later on that when you, uh, when you wield them, they drain your sanity constantly. God. Chester, I hope you're not going to have too many, uh, hey, check it out. Nightmares tonight because, um of watching Florian uh, die like that, it wasn't the best. I, I understand it wasn't the best, uh, but there were just a lot of spiders out there and uh, only one Florian, and one Florian is not enough to uh, to deal with so many spiders. Uh, fine, let's put the, uh, the boards down. We'll see what kind of night we have. Hopefully uh, it'll be a, uh, a night that involves dogs. Why is there a morsel up here? And Chester, I hope you haven't been up here resetting uh, these traps either, because I, I just had to reset that one. I have a feeling that you might have sprung it. God damn it, Chester. What have I told you about that? Um, okay, let's pick this. Let's grab the seeds. Here we go. Uh, we'll replant the seeds so that we can get even more stuff growing. Uh, I might need to make another fridge, actually, because I'm always, this fridge is always full. It's always full. Let's do it. I think uh, I've got the gears and the gold nuggets to do it. Let's do it. We're going to build another fridge right now. Right here. Right now it's going to happen. Ice box. Two, two nuggets, a gear, and a wooden plank. I can do that. Great. Uh, two nuggets. Right? Two? Yeah. Fine. We'll, uh, we'll take two. Oh, I think you control. Oh, no. Is it shift? Control splits the stack in half. Oh, that's very good to know, actually. Uh, it was that, that, and gears. Chester's got my supply of gears. I'm stuck in the fire. Sorry about that, Chester. Give me those gears. Great. Okay, I've got the gears. We are now going to make, uh, another ice box. We'll place it, uh, close to this ice box. If not, like, right beside it would be nice, actually. There we go. Place it up here. Hey, fantastic. Okay, great. Let's put this morsel in here so that it doesn't go bad. Uh, and then we can harvest the rest of this junk too and shove it into the other ice box. Uh, and then we can start really, really stockpiling food uh, for the winter. That would be nice. I think there's already corn in this one. There is. Oh, and there's eggplant in this one. Oh, look, I didn't even need to build that. Oh, well, it's okay. It's fine. Maybe I can have one for ingredients and one for, uh, for full meals. There we go. Uh, we'll put this in here then. Great. Okay. Fine. Oh, shit. I just realized, actually. We've also got some taffy. Oh, here they come. Here they come. Shit. All right. We got this. We're going to do it. Chester, stay back. 
No, Chester, please. Stay there. You're gonna have to stay there, Chester. Uh, if I can store this. We're under attack. We're under attack big time. Uh, where's my backpack? I could probably do with actually having this backpack because it's got my spear in it. Great. Fine. Backpack. Spear. Wherever it is. There it is. I'm ready. Football helmet. Here they come, Chester. Watch out. They're attacking my walls. Don't do it, you dogs. You mangy dogs. There's one dead. Another one has just lit uh, that flower on fire. Is he dead? They're attacking the walls. Oh my god. Holy shit. This is intense. I just picked up that track by accident. Oh, here we go. Dead. Another one bites the dust. Oh my god. Chester, are you being attacked by dogs? It's okay. I'll, I'll, I'll help you. God, these ones are, are really, really angry. Look at how angry these dogs are. Whew. My goodness. Chester. That was intense. There was a lot of dogs. Um... Luckily, oh look, we got some free ashes too, uh, which we don't need actually. We're gonna drop those. We've got tons of ashes. Uh, good job, Chester. Chester like sort of tanked all of those dogs as well. That was really good. Uh, so we got some more hound's teeth. Burn, burn, burn faster. I can't quite. There we go. Get this. Uh, actually, I'll drop that on the ground. Let's uh, let's get our backpack back on. Great. Uh, we'll put this here. Monster meat. Uh, gears. Chester, you can have back put my hat back on great uh, crisis averted day 82 well 81 going into 82 attacked by dogs we survived we're still alive to tell the tale uh, which means that we now have a couple of days where we can oh, is that a red gem oh fantastic great okay um, oh look there's a rabbit like stuck inside the walls here ah, take that you bastard look at that that's fantastic um, Oh, there's a dead butterfly out here. One of our flowers got roasted. Uh, thankfully, that's all it was. Just one flower got toasted by those uh, fire hounds. Very good. Jesus Christ, God. You gotta hate when you get attacked by hell hounds. Uh, they're the absolute worst. I think I picked up some traps accidentally as well. That's the ones at 90%. Oh, look, there's another tooth here. And uh, there was another one here somewhere. There it is, 90% as well. Fine. God, that worked out really well. Uh, we didn't actually need to attack them too, too much in the end. Uh, the traps uh, more or less took care of, uh, well, a, a great great bulk of them, uh, which is very good. God damn it. So um, it looks like we lost a butterfly and, and one flower, and uh, but gained like a ton of hound's teeth that we can use for traps and stuff, uh, which is good, and, uh, and a bunch of other crap too. Uh, holy shit, look at all this crap that I have. I really have a ton of crap. Uh, I'm not really keeping track of how much crap I have. Oh shit, there's some marble in there, okay. Grab this marble out of here and put it in here, because uh, we got some in here already. Five pieces! We can almost uh, make another marble suit. There's probably enough in those columns at that other place to, uh, to mine it all up and make another marble suit. Great, okay, monster meat. Let's uh, hang these babies out to dry uh, to make some jerky that we can use uh, to make some more meals. Uh, I've got two seeds here that I can plant very quickly. Uh, day 82 is sort of coming to a close. Uh, that shouldn't stop us though. I think we've got... Uh, oh, I need some logs. Do I have any logs left? Or did I turn them all into... I think I did. God, Jesus. Okay, well, we can chop down some trees. We can make a, uh, we can make a fire out in the wilderness and go out and do some, uh, do some exploring after, probably. Uh, what do we want to do with this? That's an ingredient. There we go. We can store it in there. What are these whole f these fucking petals? Jesus. I don't even think I can do anything with them. We're going to have to eat some meatballs. Fine. There we go. We ate some meatballs. Uh, let's store that in there because uh, we killed that rabbit. And uh, we'll store these down in here because uh, we'll hang these out to dry. Fine. Okay. Got a whole bunch of rabbits in there. Stay away from that seed, you bastard. Take that. Uh... Rearrange that. Great. Okay, we're back on top of things. I'll just harvest all this up and store it in the fridge uh, so that we can plant some more stuff uh, with the uh, seeds that we'll inevitably get uh, from going out into the wilderness because uh, we're like uh, Bear grills. once we're out there. There's no stopping us. We're going to be getting all sorts of cool shit. It's going to be great. Uh, look at that rabbit. He's like totally eyeing up that carrot. What a son of a bitch. Uh, okay. Fine. We'll head out. 
we can head out now, I think. Uh, I've got a, uh, I've got this wooden axe, and I think I've got a shovel too. Good, I can, sho I can shovel up some of this stuff, and then we can at least make a campfire while we're out there. We'll go do some exploring. Maybe we can actually go find the, this elephant. We can fo follow the tracks. I think there were some tracks back here. Let's do that. Let's finally do this. We'll, we'll find this elephant, and then maybe we can, uh, at long last, make some sort of coat or something. That might be nice, actually. I think Willow is at the point in her life where she thinks, yeah, that would be great. Here we go. Our first suspicious dirt pile. Which way is it leading? I think this way. Is there another one over here somewhere? I'm sort of like following following the track, I think. Or did I just go like the wrong way? I don't see another track out here. Okay. It must be leading this way then. Are these the toes? Yeah, they do. Those do actually look like toes. Okay, fine. We'll head this way and see if we can find another. Oh, look. How did we miss this? Look, how did we miss him? He walked right through our camp and we totally missed him. We must have been asleep. Chester, I thought maybe you would have uh, been keeping track. Oh, actually, Chester, you can come with me. Well, we haven't really made it too far from the camp. I was hoping to, like, actually get out of camp today. Chester, come with me. We're, we're still doing it. We're not staying home tonight. We're going we're gonna to go out through the wilderness. We're going to find this elephant because I've never seen this elephant. And I think it might be nice to see the elephant. Uh, are we heading the right way? We've lost the... Uh, the dirt trail. It must be up this way then. Okay, Chester. We're gonna need a campfire pretty soon. Seems kind of dumb to like uh, have a uh, campfire out in the wilderness while we're so close to our, our home. But it's getting dark and I can't actually see the suspicious dirt piles anymore. Uh, so we might have to do it. Oh shit, look at this haunted graveyard, Chester. My sanity is really taking, taking a massive shit. I don't see any dirt piles over here either. So, maybe they're down? Oh, God. It's really hard to follow these dirt piles, as it turns out, actually. Fine. We're going to camp out uh, close to this haunted graveyard. And hopefully we won't get attacked uh, by, by anything while we're out here. Do I have enough for a straw roll? It might be nice to sleep tonight. No, I need some grass. And I need some rope, too. God. All right. I won't make rope just yet. If there's some grass around here, I'll take it. But... I don't think there... Oh, there's just like a little tiny bit. I'm going to have to head back over. Oh, there's the other one. Here we go. We're on the trail. Uh, Chester, I almost called you Fester again. Oh, shit, look at that. I was like stuck right in the dark. Whew, that was close. Are we going to be able to uh, to make it through tonight with just this crappy little fire, Chester? What do you think? It's a short night. It's, there's probably nothing to worry about. I wouldn't worry too much about it. It's kind of scary camping out here uh, all by yourself. But uh, not so scary when you know that you've got like at least 10 days before the next dog attack. Uh, the vicious um, dogs that, uh, that light on fire when you kill them and burn down all of your crops and your bushes. Or, or in my case, one flower and a butterfly. The only casualties of the, the uh, great attack of day uh, 81 leading into day 82, I think. Uh, that's probably right. Uh, Jesus, it's going to be close anyway, Chester. Look at how small the flame is. How long does it actually last when it's that small? Look, I'm, I'm ready with the grass, just in case. I think we're okay, though. I think, uh... There we go. Look at that. We did it. I don't know what that sound was, the, the ding-dong sound, but uh, I'm sure we'll find out at some point. Uh, here we go. We're on the trail of the elephant. It's saying to go up this way. Uh, so let's do it. Oh, I like how you can actually follow these trails. Uh, like, I I'm, I'm pretty dumb. Uh, and I and I pretty much suck at computer games, but even I'm finding this somewhat easy. Even though before, like uh, probably even two minutes ago, I said it was very hard. It's not actually okay. Chester, this way. If you see any berries or anything, let me know because we're getting a little bit hungry. Uh, but we should be okay. I'll find you. Oh shit! Is that a sign? Oh, Chester, look at this. Chester, it's an elephant! Oh, 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 what are we gonna do? Can we... Oh! Okay, Chester. Oh, shit, Chester, watch out! Oh, shit. No. Here we go. We're gonna freeze him, if we can, with our ice staff. Oh, we got him. Okay, take this, you son of a bitch. Oh, look at this! What a son of a bitch! I can't even click on him, his legs are too long. I'm, I'm just going to toast him, Chester. Don't worry. Just stand there and watch me. It's absolutely fine. 
Jeez, these things hit really hard. Oh, look at this. Proper meat. Oh, it's really good. Actually, we, we needed some. All right, let's see if we can freeze this elephant. And then once we've frozen him, uh, we'll kill him, hopefully. Is he hard? Is he frozen? He's frozen. Okay. Take this elephant. Oh, my God. He, the freezing did not last long. Look, I'm just going absolutely nuts on this guy. Let's try to dodge this next attack. Oh, we did it. Big dodge. Oh. Okay, we killed an elephant, Chester. Uh, sadly. I mean... It, it's, it wasn't actually the best. I don't feel too great about the whole thing. Um, we're going to have to put this stuff into our backpack, I think. I think I've got some space in the old backpack. Look at all the meat. Stay away from this meat, you stupid crows. It's my meat. Look, I just killed... Oh, look, we got a trunk. We got all this meat. Is that poop? Oh, he was pooping out here. Oh, the lone pooper. Out here all by himself pooping. God damn. Okay, great. Oh, that worked out really well. Jeez, we actually killed an elephant. Uh, and we got, like, a ton of meat for it, too. Look at all this meat. Holy shit, I think we can use this, like, proper meat to make meat stew. Uh, it might happen, Chester. I know, I'm, I'm pretty excited as well. Uh, we had to kill, uh, old laser eye, or one of the old laser eyes that, uh, inhabits this area of the map, uh, because he was, uh, he was getting really frisky. God, it's gotta be said. Um, fine. Great. What a, what a day. Day 83. One to remember, Chester. Holy shit, that was really good. Uh, we gotta find some grass now. And there's some over here. Great. I'll grab these twigs, too. We'll get a, a bunch of grass, and then we'll uh, use a bedroll tonight. Because uh, we're actually dipping down into the depths of uh, insanity. And it's not the best. We'll also chop down a couple of these big fuckers, too, uh, on our way. Pick up the logs. Jeez. Oh my god. That, that was... That was quite a rough one, actually. I mean, how many how many chops does it take to chop down a big tree? There's too many chops. Uh, we'll get a couple of logs uh, so that we can make some boards when we get back to camp. And uh, hopefully we can make some sort of cool puffy vest. Uh, like one, like a, rapier, like a rapper's vest. That'd be fantastic. Especially if we found some silver paint. We could paint our puffy uh, vest silver. Uh, and then we could just sort of like walk around and, and uh, like high five each other all day long, Chester, and just, like, generally have a pretty fantastic time. I hope I don't need more than uh, one of these trunks. I was kind of hoping that it would drop more than one trunk, but uh, having said that, I suppose um, it wouldn't really make much sense because he only has one trunk to drop. Um, I always found that weird, like, in MMOs and stuff, like, when it told you to go out and get, uh, collect bear noses from bears, like, if you had to collect, for instance, say, uh, ten bear noses go out and uh, every once in a while you'd have a bear that just didn't have a nose but then sometimes uh, it would be weird you'd have a bear that dropped like three noses but um, you know looking at the bear it looked like he only actually had one nose so I don't know it's a bit of a weird one maybe uh, if you know the answer uh, to why that is uh, I would love to hear it actually you can like maybe just like uh, send my dad an email and let him know oh shit I think we forgot a monster meat oh, we did as well great Panic room is all cleaned up, uh, which is nice. Uh, oh, look at this. The jerky is ready. We can harvest this jerky and uh, we can dry this off here as well. Great. There's some more monster meat in this chest, I believe, that we can hang out to dry too. And uh, that's great because we can make more meatballs without uh, killing any rabbits. I think our karma is probably not the best right now after killing that uh, poor elephant. But, uh, but there you go. Ah. Uh. Home sweet home, Chester. And a full belly, too. It's a nice feeling. Uh, let's, uh, let's leave these logs in here just in case we need them. I got some seeds here as well that I can plant. It looks like it's still hot as hell. Uh, so we're probably, uh, still at the height of the summer, which is nice. Uh, a little bit disappointed with the old bee box. Um, there's no, there's no honey to be had. In this Oh, shit. Oh, look at this. Look at this jackass. What the hell is he doing here? Jesus Christ, that really scared me, too. Oh, look at these bushes. Chester, I need your stuff. I need I need your stuff here. Okay, we're going to fertilize all this stuff. Oh, look at this. Fertilizing the bushes with all this rot. Uh, we could probably... Th I got a whole bunch of petals that I don't mind letting go to rot either, um, Chester, if you're worried about your collection dwindling. You've only got 21 pieces of rot left. Uh, but you've got 45 pine cones. It's fantastic. Oh, here's four more for you as well. I'm so happy. Fucking loves a pine cone. And, and who can blame him? Jesus Christ. Gotta love a pine cone. Uh, fine. Okay, let's, um, 
Oh, maybe this big meat can be used for something. Let's double check. Uh, let's see. Dress. Uh, rabbit earmuffs we've made. Uh, oh, garland we've already made as well. Straw hat we've made. A beefalo hat. Hmm. And you thought they smelled bad on the outside. If I get a beefalo horn, I can make one of these. Okay, great. Uh, a beekeeper hat I need some silk for. I do not have silk. Uh, a feather hat. Dress for your head. Use an alchemy engine to build a prototype. I don't know... Oh, tentacle spots. I could probably get some of those. And I think I've got some crow feathers, and it shouldn't be too hard to get some red bird feathers, so that's fine. A bush hat. Ooh. Look at this. Good for hiding. Apparently, uh, these are quite fun, actually. I might make one. It might be good. Silk for a top hat. I can't do it. A walking cane. What is this? What's a walrus tusk? God, that looks fantastic. I would love to have a, a walking cane. Whoops. Uh, what about this stuff? A dapper vest, a breezy vest, warm but light enough for summer, uh, okay, and, and a puffy vest. What's this? A winter co-elephant trunk, puffy vest, warm enough for winter storms. Oh, okay, so beefalo wool, silk, okay, so I do need some silk before I can do anything with uh, this trunk. Fine. Uh, and the trunk I can eat as well. It's perishable, <laughs> so I better store it in the fridge. God damn, that is disgusting. That is really disgusting. And look at these creepy eyes looking at me. I've, I've got... Chester, I don't want you to judge me harshly, but I've actually got an elephant trunk in my fridge right now. Uh, and, I, and I know, it's, it is kind of disgusting. Uh, fine. I want to make a bedroll. Do I have enough? Oh, God. I need to make a rope, and I'm not going to have enough grass. Can you believe it? Jesus. Uh, and we need food, too. And there's all these creepy things. My God. What has happened? It's day 84. God, I didn't even, like, notice that it was night. I'm just, like, getting so carried away here. I'm just, like, so excited after killing an elephant. That was absolutely nuts. God, that was so worth doing as well. All right, Chester. Uh, I'm going to put these on the ground, these pe uh, stale petals, uh, so that they can go to rot, and then we can replenish your supplies. Put the berries in there. Monster jerky. Uh, let's just store this monster jerky in here. And uh, let's eat some meatballs. Mmm. Great. Uh, we'll harvest these meatballs and stick them into the fridge as well. And we got a little pretty good system there, actually, now, Chester. It's, it's, it's pretty good. Uh, big meat. Is that used for anything? Uh, I can't remember it being used for anything. I think you can make a meat effigy with it, but apparently an amulet is better than, uh, than a meat effigy. What do I need for an amulet? Oh, protects you from death. Use the shadow manipulator to build a prototype. Okay, so if I get living logs, I can make this amulet. I just need some nightmare fuel. I've got a red gem, and I've got more than enough gold nuggets. Uh, oh my god, this would be good. Even a crazed musician can amass quite a following. Use the shadow manipulator. I really need to get this shadow manipulator. I need to I need to get this, uh, these living logs. God damn it. A dark sword as well. That's pretty fantastic. Uh, okay, Chester, it's day 84. What the hell do you want to do today? Uh, what could we possibly do today? I mean, there's always a lot of stuff to do today. We could try to invoke the wrath of the uh, Keeper of the Forest if we can find um, a lot of trees. There seem to be a lot of trees down here. I've still got my torch. Uh, let's torch up some of these big trees and see if we can do this. That'd be nice. If, if we get this guy out here this episode, uh, it, it might be nice. Uh, it might be a nice episode. It'll be like action packed because we killed an elephant, old laser eye, and then also uh, potentially the keeper of the forest. Uh, I'm just going to keep lighting all this stuff on fire and see what happens. These saplings are taking a little bit of a beating. We're going for the big trees. Come on, you big bastard. Where are you? We're ready for you. I don't know how much is left. 15% left on the old torch. Look at this. All this grass is going up. I'm being very careless. Uh, another one here. Fine. Can we get anything else? My, oh, no. The fire is gone. Okay. There's a berry bush here, though. Okay. We've left, uh, we've left a, a real gigantic mess in our wake here. Uh, is this guy mad yet? Is he coming after us? Can you hear him, Chester? I don't see him. I've burnt down a lot of trees. I might have to burn down more. Fine. We'll do it. We've got, we've got more. Come on, Keeper of the Forest. We're ready. We're ready to face you at long last. Uh, we'll lead you into a den of spiders. <laughs> and then we'll watch you guys all royal rumble each other to death. It's going to be great. Uh, I'm just going to go around and light every tree I can on fire until uh, this guy turns up. Uh, because we want to get some living logs so we can build a shadow manipulator. Oh, that's going to be fantastic. Do you see him yet, Chester? Did Chester just disappear? No, no, there he is. Okay. You with me, Chester? No? Coming? 
Um, my god. It doesn't matter what I try. Uh, I cannot seem to get this Keeper of the Forest uh, angry enough to come after me. I've left like a trail of destruction in my wake, and still, uh, he's not interested. Maybe he just feels bad for me because like I'm just a, an innocent little girl wearing a, a summer hat out in the middle of the wilderness on day 84. Uh, well, midday 84. Uh, oh, there's no frogs up here. Where did all the frogs go? Huh. If I had a bit of silk, I could make a fishing rod and do some fishing. Uh, sadly, um, I'm at the point now where I don't think I'll ever get any silk again. Uh, because, God damn it, all those spiders uh, seem to travel around in massive groups together. And there's not much I can do uh, to them. But if I get this Keeper of the Forest guy up, uh, I could potentially kite him over to where they live. And, uh, and uh, they could all fight together. Oh, what was that? No. Okay. Still, still nothing. I'm burning trees. Uh, with, uh, with a high level of gusto, and he still doesn't seem to care. God, this Keeper of the Forest is not a very good Keeper of the Forest. I mean, if I entrusted my forest to a Keeper and found out that this uh, kind of behavior was happening out in the forest, I would be pretty pissed, actually. Uh, I would probably fire his ass, and, uh, and then I would demand uh, that he did a better job uh, keeping the next forest that he decided to, uh, to get a job. Uh, overseeing because this isn't good enough. We're gonna have to sleep through uh, day 84 into day 85 to regain a little bit of sanity. I think we regain a little bit of san sanity with the uh, with the straw roll uh, at a cost to like a massive amount of hunger. I can't make a tent because I don't have any silk. Uh, I'm gonna have to man up at some point and fight spiders, but uh, I don't want to do it right now. God damn it! I can't believe it. It's nighttime already. Just collect this grass so that I can make some rope and uh, bed roll. And then uh, I'll make sure that I also have uh, some meatballs ready to go, too. I think I do, though. I think I've got some meatballs all set to go. Come on, Chester. Uh, we're going to head back to camp. Uh, and maybe see if we can, no, chop, 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 hover over some of these and see. No? No, he doesn't seem to be angry whatsoever, uh, which is either a, a good thing or a bad thing. Maybe it just means that we can just spend a whole bunch of time uh, chopping down, like, tons of trees. Nice. Okay. Uh, did I get any logs while I was out there? No, I burnt down like a billion trees and I didn't get any logs. Unbelievable. Where's my shovel? Uh, oh, here it is. Right here. Great. Okay. Ah, uh, no, not that. We want to dig these. There we go. Grab four of these, make a plank, and then, uh, we can light the fire. Oh, God, I don't even need to do that, actually, because I'm just going to sleep tonight. All right, let's do that instead. Uh, I'll get this rope. Oh, I can make it already. I've got some rope, apparently. Here we go. Straw roll. Go nuts. Uh, it's time for sleep. Good night, Chester. See you tomorrow. I'm not even leaving a fire on for you. <laughs> what a guy. Uh, oh my god. We're very hungry. Look at that. We've woken up. It's day 85 and we're starving. Uh, like there's no tomorrow. Uh, not for long, though, because we had meatballs for breakfast. Which is kind of gross. It's got to be said. Uh, very gross. Uh, let's store all that in there until we can figure out what we want to do with it. Uh, we've got monster meat. Oh, actually, I think if we take... Is it two meats... Uh, um, and a monster meat, and possibly a twig, or is it just like another uh, one of these ones? A morsel. Let's try it with the morsel. Okay, let's try this. This might make meat stew. I don't know if this is like a huge waste of meat. We'll find out, though. If this makes meat stew, that might be good. Uh, apparently, meat stew is very good. Uh, I've never had it before, so I, I, I'll trust you guys. Um, and, and hopefully, you guys don't have really terrible taste in, in food in general. I don't think you do, though. We should be fine. Oh shit, look at that! <laughs> There's a bone sticking out of it! Oh, that's fantastic! Uh, let's see what this does for hunger. Uh, we have meaty stew. Uh, so I put two full meats, a uh, monster meat jerky, and a morsel in there, and this is what I got. Uh, is it going to be good for hunger and sanity? Whoa! <laughs> yes! Holy crap! Okay, sanity is back up to 135 thanks to sleeping through the night and... Uh, potentially eating that uh, monster meat stew. I think actually eating something like monster meat s stew is like a bit more sustenance. So like you don't get a a hungry as quick. You, like you, s you stay full up for a longer time, uh, which is good to know actually. It's very good. Because uh, you could potentially just make like one of those every day. 
or every two days or something, and uh, and not have to blast through your reserves of food. Oh, Jesus. I'm doing all this one at a time because basically I've just got way too many ingredients. Look at all the food in here. It's nuts. I don't think I have enough seeds to replant all this either. Oh, God damn it. There's really disgusting durian in here. Or good, actually. A lot of people say that they taste very good, but uh, I don't know. Oh, here you go, Chester. Just in time. Look at this. We're going to shove this in here, and we'll shove that in there as well. And I think there's carrots in here, too. We'll put the jerky in there, even though it's probably not going to go bad. And there you go, Chester. For all your hard work, there's 14 more rots to add uh, to your collection. God damn it, Chester. You are one effing son of a bitch. That is great. Okay, uh, let's put all this grass uh, in... Well, actually, let's just hang on to it. It's good to have when we're out on the field. And uh, we can probably wrap up there, Chester. Day 85. Holy shit. Uh, we fought off another wave of angry dogs. We'll do another one in about six days' time. We killed an elephant, which was pretty cool. Uh, we're going to have to try to kill a winter elephant if we want to make the winter vest by the looks of it. And we're going to have to figure out some way of uh, killing spiders to get their silk. Um, but that, uh, that can all wait uh, for next time. As usual, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you soon.